If you're looking for the best sports memorabilia and card break room on the internet, you've come to the right place. Welcome to Ultimate Autographs Live Break Room. Tonight's action will move fast, so we want to prep you for what you're about to see on your screen. First, the all-important dice roll number. At the top of the show, the host will randomize a series of numbers. The number selected from the randomizer will become the dice roll number for the entire show. Meaning every mystery box that is broken, the names of every collector will be placed on a list and randomized using the dice roll number for the show. Next, you see this black ticker down here? This shows you which numbers are still available in each and every Ultimate Autographs mystery box series. When a break fills or sells out, the host will ask for a number. This is where you make your selection from. Simply type a number in the chat and the host will pick the first number they see. Throughout the show, you may see two different types of breaks, divisional and top spot. Divisional breaks are most common. In this format, all eight individuals who enter a football theme break will be positioned next to one of eight football divisions after their names are randomized using the show's dice roll number. When the mystery box is opened, the football division of the team represented in that mystery box becomes the winning division. The lucky collector whose name is randomly placed next to that football division takes home the signed piece of authenticated memorabilia. Our top spot format is typically reserved for giveaways, college theme series, and non-football breaks. In a top spot break, all names are added to a list. They are randomized using the show's dice roll number. At the end of the randomization, the name at the top becomes the winner of the signed item or prize. Breaking sports memorabilia has never been easier or more fun than it is in Ultimate Autograph's live break room. Remember, every mystery box series you see on the show can also be purchased as a personal mystery box that is either shipped directly to your home for you to open, or you can request to have it opened on a future Ultimate Autograph's live breaks broadcast. Also, while you're waiting for your break to fill, we encourage you to look around ultimateautographs.com to see if you find a piece of memorabilia you love and want to add to your collection. And don't forget, every live break spot you purchase automatically earns you 6% back in UA cash that you can later exchange for a mystery box or a signed item of your choosing. All right, the time has come. Let's break some certified, authentic sports memorabilia in Ultimate Autographs Live Break Room. Tell them, boys. What is going on, everybody? Welcome to the Ultimate Autographs Live Break Studio. It is Wednesday Night Magic here. I'm Donnie. <laughs> That's Chris. Guys, thank you very much for joining us on an exciting night here in the UA Live Break Room. we got a couple things pre-filled. we got another customer appreciation giveaway for tonight. Every time you guys buy into a break, every time you guys purchase a spot in a break, you will get a top spot entry for an autographed Devontae Adams Green Bay Packers speed replica helmet. Pretty cool. It is cool. Very, very cool, in my opinion. I mean, Headline. something cool that we're kind of giving back to you guys with. Uh, but every time you guys buy a spot, Chris will be updating the list from earlier today. People that bought in for tonight's breaks and then tonight's breaks as well. Everybody that bought in gets a spot in tonight's. Win or lose. Yeah, true. Win or lose. Guys, thanks for joining us. Let's do our dice roll for tonight. Let me get the last one off the screen. Dice roll earlier was 12. And tonight... 7. Do you think it's going to be 7? It's going to be 7. Okay. I think it's going to be 8. I just have a feeling. I got a fever. Here we go. Dice roller on the screen. Dice roll for tonight is a 4. Not good enough. One more time on it. 6 and 3 gives us a 9. 9 on tonight's dice roll number. First break of the night, everybody. We're going to do a pitch and catch jersey. Pitch and catch jersey for tonight. Uh, that is an autographed jersey per box. Autographed jersey per box. Come with the headliners. Mari Cooper, Calvin Johnson, uh, Odell Beckham, another headliner listed in that series. Torrey Holt was a headliner listed in that series. Uh, we had DeAndre Hopkins, Drew Locke in that series. So the big idea behind the pitch and catch is that some of the headliners are wide receivers and some of the headliners being wide and uh, quarterbacks. That's all I've got to say about it. <laughs> I didn't have anything else. We have a Dutch auction item for tonight, one of the bigger ones that we're releasing. 
Uh, we sold the Darius Leonard earlier this afternoon. Kat Katrina Perrine snagged that Darius Leonard. Uh, so tonight's going to be another Eclipse Speed Authentic. We're going to go to A.J. Brown. A.J. Brown is a Titans wide receiver. We'll show you guys that Eclipse Speed Authentic in just a little bit of time. 7, 8, number 9 on the dice roll. The randomizer is finished. The divisions are ready to rock and roll. Let's get a box number for pitch and catch jersey number 1. Thursday night break, Chris. How are you feeling? First of all, it's Wednesday. Why do we keep thinking it's Thursday? <laughs> but, the, yeah, it feels good to be a Thursday night, yeah. For a Thursday I night? I thought it was Thursday, too. Dude, I, seriously, I it was today. am way off. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know what's going on right now. <laughs> Garrett's birthday today. Garrett Campbell. Garrett Campbell's oh, birthday. Yeah. So we wish, wish, wish Garrett happy birthday. Of course. Says he's gonna. Got, had, a, had a full day scheduled today. She's getting hammered. I don't think Garrett's the type to do that. He's not. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, happy birthday, Garrett. Happy birthday, Garrett. Dustin Downham says got entered in that Bo Jackson helmet giveaway. I hope I win. Bo Jackson helmet. I don't know that one. Me neither. Bo Jackson, maybe uh, he is mistaking that for the Devontae Adams, potentially? Is he in the chat? Dustin Downham? Yes. Pitch and catch. Let me randomize these box numbers. Let's get this show on the road. Bo oh, Jackson. Up. Wrong, ch right church, wrong pew, maybe? Right idea, wrong name? <laughs> right church, wrong pew. Five, six, seven, eight. Number nine, we're going to do box number 38 for tonight for first break of the day. It's a pitch and catch black box jersey, 38, Chris. Famous 38. I only got one. Oh, Jack. All right, let's get this show on the road, a little divisional break. Donnie is the Flag Day top spot giveaway tonight. Chris Brown. Uh, we did no, no. That'll be done t Friday right. night. We're letting everybody know uh, since the original day was back in June. Anybody that won, we want to make sure that they uh, know when it is. So. It was way back in June. Yeah, it was supposed to be June twenty fifth. So, <laughs> yeah. hey, yeah. better late than never. Never late is better. We're gonna do Friday, Friday night on that. First break of the wow. First break of the night. How about this? Start maybe the best wide receiver in recent memory. Calvin Johnson, Megatron, Detroit Lions, who's got the NFC North, a Hall of Fame inscription as well for Calvin Johnson. Aiden nice. Sabatinelli in the NFC North is taken. That is a beautiful hit. Uh, fast start. Aiden, let's go. Banger. Fast Way start. to start. Uh, Raul says, did the five full-size helmet fill up? It did earlier in this afternoon's break. If you want to re Watch the break. It is posted to YouTube. You guys got to go rewatch that. That was fun. That was towards the end of the show for this afternoon's break. Five box break. We did show the winner and all five items. Calvin Johnson jersey. Banger. We do have a new th three box break up for tonight. Chris, you want to break down what's in that? Will I write this winner? Triple break mixer. So this is going to be a 4th of July authentic, a 4th of July mixer, and a luxury lid. Yep. Top spot. It's a, it's a top spot break, 10 spots. Top spot wins the 4th of July Authentic and the 4th of July Mixer. Second prize, Luxury Lids. So, three three chances, three three wins there. What's, okay. what's nice about that is you have a chance for three headliners. Three different series, three different headliners. So, uh, You guys want to tell you what, Chris? That's a good start to the night with that Calvin Johnson. That is yeah, a, you're not gonna go any. You're not gonna get much. That's a heater for the jersey. Yeah. All right, let's do let's do that luxury lid next. Riley Strack, Danny Hunter, who is sending us crumble cookies, by the way. Crumble cookies. Uh, in that triple break, you have ten spots available, but in the description says an eight spot divisional break. Well, let me get over there and fix it right now. A little trouble there. Uh, one second. That'd be a mixer. Oops. Mm. 
Mission to True Wake Ten spots available. We can do more of those five five break helmets if there's interest. It was something new we tried. It seemed to go well. Mm -hmm. Make up uh, what do we got going on there? What's going on over there, Donnie? It sounds like you're I am. booking a flight. <laughs> yeah. I sound like you Have you ever seen Bruce Almighty? You ever seen Bruce Almighty when he's answering all the prayers? And he's like... <laughs> I love I don't, it. I don't know if I've seen that movie. You ever seen Bruce Almighty with Jim Carrey? You're a movie guy, too. Dang it. I don't know. Uh, no, I, I think I don't think I saw Evan Almighty. No, I Evan think Almighty I saw was Bo. Terrible. And Evan Almighty was really bad. That was the bad one, yeah. And that's just how the cookie crumbles. And that's, that's the way the cookie crumbles. Do we have a box number for the luxury lids? Luxury lids, full size helmet break, break two for the afternoon or for the night. Gentlemen, how are you? So I'm still having issues with UA Cash. I'm only using a couple bucks at a whack. Unless that's all I actually have, then it's giving my false info by telling me uh, I own have almost fifty dollars. Chris, I'm on it. You're on the case. We did figure out the glitch. You just have to go back and... It's a glitch in the system. I'm the machine! Box 32. Chris Brown and Travis say I'm in the same boat as Chris. Well, email... Don't email customer service. Email operations at ultimateautographs.com. Um, I'll do what I can to fix that um, in the middle of the show here. We have our ops team working on that instead of uh, we've we've working with our our uh, rewards program. Guys, so if you're having an issue it. with the UA Cash, let me just help you out here. If you're having an issue with the UA, UA Cash, I did put the link oh, yeah, put it in there. to the email in the chat. If you are having an issue with UA Cash, just hit that email. Our ops team is working on fixing our UA Cash issues. If we like you. If we don't, then sorry. That's the problem that we faced, right? No better hint. We'll get it fixed. All right. All right, next item. Luxury lid, black box helmet. It is headed to... What's up, Jay? Going to a throwback... Wow, nice hit. Throwback New York Giant. That is Rodney Hampton. Rodney Hampton. What's up, Jay Sorensen? Good to see you, brother, in here. Rodney Hampton, Super Bowl champ. 27, going to the NFC East for Robert Boulay. Nice hit, Rob. Bobby, that's slime. Speed rep, little throwback hit, though. I like that style of helmet. Six. Two, four. Hampton. Bang. Nice pull. Nice pull. Rodney Hampton. Speed replica for the New York Giants. The New York Giants. In that movie. Little Giants? No. Welcome, New York Giants. It's a pretty good impersonation, if I can lie. I am King Julian. Coming to America. No. I don't know. That. Madagascar. I don't know if I've seen Madagascar. Come on. That's Eddie Murphy's best work. Or Chris Rock's best work. <laughs> Chris Rock, best work. As the zebra, Melvin. I say I don't even I don't even know. I don't know if his name was Melvin, actually. <laughs> Melvin was the giraffe who was played I... by David Schwimmer. There you go. Alex the Lion, Ben Stiller. Alright. <laughs> I never sure, saw it. I'm not sure Gabriel's never seen it. I'm I sure Gabriel's seen, seen it. I don't know if he's seen it. It's an awesome movie for kids. I'm sure. I, I don't know if he. I don't know. I haven't seen it. I don't know. Gabriel might be watching. He'll, he'll, he'll let us know. <laughs> yeah. Gabriel in the chat. <laughs> Number one fan. He was number one. A lot of movie quotes. All right, time for a diamond 
Helmet Box. Dwayne Wright, Chris Hammers, Nathaniel Thomas, Zachary Erickson, Chris Hannon, Chris Wells, Micah Gregory. Thank you guys for the fill on the Diamond Helmets. Look at this. Let's go. We got a box number. Number 20. Dice rolls 9. Here we go. Box number 20. We like to... So we're still looking for a couple headliners available in this series. And by a couple, I mean a bunch of them. Now, the fun part is about the Diamond Series that it is a live break exclusive. Live break exclusive. So we're going to see all the items in the room. Big fan of those. Speed Flex debut for us. And the break. Not for a while, yeah. Let's see if we can pull one of those bad boys in this break. Speed Authentics are better. That's that's the big hit, I think, in my opinion. Speed Authentics are better. That's that Speed Flex. It's always cool to see. Yeah. Oof. Here we go. Tampa Bay Buccaneers for Dwayne Wright. It is Derek Brooks. Derek Brooks, one of the best middle linebackers of all time. Dwayne Wright in the NFC South. Wayne all right. 632. And it's Derek Brooks. How you doing over there, Chris? I'm, I'm swell. Are you? Yeah. I'm good now that you're here, Donnie. Full shoulder. <laughs> there we go. Uh, let's see. What's up, Aiden? Derek Brooks, amazing linebacker, Super Bowl champ. Why don't we show that Dutch? We can do that. We can do that. There we go, Dwayne. Congrats, buddy. Moving through some of these pre-fills. If you guys want to go ahead and give us a box number for the 4th of July, authentic, I will show off the Dutch auction for tonight. Pure. I don't know. I should be in. That thing looks money. I'll try to find it. Dutch auction item for tonight. AJ Brown, full size helmet. Guys, I'm going to play you a quick video which breaks down how the Dutch auction items work in the UA live break room. Introducing Ultimate Autographs Dutch Auction. So, you're probably wondering, what is Ultimate Autographs Dutch Auctions, and how do Dutch Auctions work? Well, it's pretty simple actually. Every once in a while, an oopsie happens, somewhere between the item being signed and the item arriving at Ultimate Autographs. These oopsies come in many shapes and sizes, like scratches, minor dents, or something very small that you can usually only see if you really pay attention. Because Ultimate Autographs prides itself on only providing collectors with the best of the best, we do not put these items in any of our mystery boxes, nor do we list them on our website. However, we know there are savvy collectors who are not worried about a tiny little scratch, if it means they can get a big name for very cheap. Therefore, we're going to Dutch auction these items with minor defects. When one of these items becomes available, it will be Dutch auctioned during the UA Live Breaks broadcast you're watching. As the show progresses, the price of the item will slowly lower until it hits rock bottom price. If you want to add the item to your collection, you can either wait until it hits rock bottom price, or you can snag it early, if you fear another collector in the room is interested in the item. To purchase the item at its current price, simply purchase it on a UA Live Break Room page, like you would any UA Live Break Spot. We hope you enjoyed this exciting game. Let the Dutch auctions begin! Veel geluk! All right, Dutch auction video. This will drop in price uh, every 10 minutes. Every 10 minutes. What's up, Chuck Barrett? Chuck Barrett says, luxury lids filled yet? Is luxury lids filled yet? We did luxury lids already, yes. 
We did do luxury lids. It was they Robert Boulay. Uh, Chuck, are you talking about luxury lids number two, potentially? Guys, Dutch auction then for tonight is this AJ Brown Eclipse Speed Authentic. So the issue is the on the decal. Where's your issue? Chris, tell me if you can see that on the stream there. should be able to see it. Sorry, I'm not watching. Hang on. Uh, hang on. We're That's delayed. Uh, not really. It looks yeah. like, yeah, point to it. There's like a... There's like a scratch in the decal. It's also like a little dent. There you go. That's a good... You can see it now. So like... The problem is all in the decal, to be honest. Just the decal. So if you're able to find these Riddell Eclipse Titans decals, this helmet can be very salvaged. Very, very salvageable. Antonio, Antonio Brown. AJ Brown. AJ Brown. There was almost another issue with it. Woo! Lower it from the start. <laughs> okay, it's dropping another 20 bucks. <laughs> Starts at 450 bucks, guys. Again, it's high end. That's a headliner. Headliner type item for tonight. All right, here we go. I'm going to randomize the boxes for the 4th of July Authentic after we get our list. If you guys would like to give us a box number, if you're in here, we're ready to go. <laughs> I just randomize it with nothing in there. <laughs> Probably get the same results. It said you must have at least two items randomized. I always do four, though. Slime one number 10. You got it, dude. Slime called 10. All right, thanks. Haircut, Chris? Uh, not recently. Maybe like. Did you notice mine? Which, yeah. one did, which one did you get cut? Right here. Just that one? Yeah. I'm trying to go short. Summer, I need short hair. You know? I go short. It's like too sweaty to have long hair. Oh. It's all that softball. <laughs> <laughs> here we go, number 10. I hope for rain for you today. It's all good. It's all good. Here we go. Box number 10, 4th of July Authentic, guys. We're looking for confetti cannons. In the boxes as free giveaway potential hits. Will there be a confetti cannon in this one? No. No, no cannon. confetti cannon. No confetti. And the hit is. So we have a Hall of Famer. Hall of Famer on a Riddell Eclipse little alternate hit Hall of Fame class of 2012. We have a Saint, Willie Rofe. Willie Rofe, offensive lineman, I believe. Offensive lineman. For, for the Saints, Hall of Famer. There you go. That goes to Zachary Erickson in the NFC South. Congrats, Zach. Nice pull. Can't go wrong with an Eclipse speed authentic. Always a solid... Saints and Chiefs, that gold pops nicely. Yeah, it's true, it does. That's very true, Keith. And that's an authentic, too. That's we're all caught up on the brakes, I believe. I got another pitch and catch. Hell yeah. Uh, I didn't mark his. There you go. All right. Uh, there you go. Pitch and catch. Pitch and catch is good to go. We just got uh, word that the Bucks and Suns game is starting right now. 2-1. Wow. Two one Phoenix Giannis with back to back forty and ten games. Booker playoff low ten points in game three. Pitching caps number two is ready to rock and roll. Let's do 30, 34, 36. I'm gonna bump that Dutch auction down. 
I'm going to bump that Dutch auction down to 435. 435, AJ Brown. If you guys have any questions about the Dutch auction item, please do not hesitate to ask. Travis, thank you very much for calling out the box number. Seven, eight, nine. Aiden was asking about the first uh, pitch and catch jersey. Aiden was not here, but Aiden, Aiden. I believe that you won. Yeah, the Calvin you, Johnson. You did jersey. all right. Aiden, let me know if you, you want to see right. that on the stream. I'll show it for you. But you did hit the Calvin Johnson. All right, next jersey, thirty-four. You did okay. Yeah, exactly. You did all right. That's always a nice surprise when you show up late and you're like, "What did I miss?" And then you missed. Your big hit. <laughs> the biggest possible jersey of the series. We'll still send it to you. In my opinion, I'll keep it. He's a guy that I would like to frame a jersey for. Calvin? Yeah, he's cool. I feel he's not like a troublemaker guy. He's kind of a good role model, right? Yeah, he was He was good. and He only played eight years. Mm -hmm. Hall of Famer. Megatron. You know, you know he, similar to Barry, didn't leave didn't Detroit. Much, right? He like handed didn't... the ball to the official. And mm -hmm. More reserved than, than players in his time. but Yeah, true. We have ourselves a... Oh, wow. This is a cool hit. So this is actually probably more valuable than his NFL stuff. Vince Young, Texas Longhorn jersey. Vince Young, Texas Longhorn. So he was in one of the most exciting Rose Bowls of all time going was, against... Uh, that was a good game. Reggie Bush and Matt, Matt Leinert. Leinert. That was Dwayne one of the best. Jarrett? Was Dwayne Jarrett on that field He too? was a wide receiver, yes. Hook'em Horns, Texas Longhorn. His longest tenure is the Tennessee Titans, I believe. This may be an AFC South hit. Let it me wasn't make 100% so sure. I want to say that he was the NFL's Offensive Rookie of the Year in 2000. Oh, he was 2006. He's a two-time Pro Bowler. He has only played for the Tennessee Titans and then one year with the Philadelphia Eagles. So this is an AFC South hit for Jimmy Mallon. Jimmy Mallon, hook him horns. Vince Young, nice pull. This is a guy we don't see very often in the break room either. Honestly, he's a guy, too, you'd rather have his college stuff than his NFL stuff, in my opinion. Oh, for sure. Just because of how awesome he was at Texas. Was he a Heisman Trophy winner in Texas? I don't know. No, because I think Bush won it that year. He also was a two-time Pro Bowler in the NFL. So pretty cool to see that he kind of translated into a decent NFL target, right? Any Pro Bowler it. seems to be okay with me. He tried to make a couple comebacks, too. I believe he went and tried to play in Canada, too. Jimmy Mallon. That's Vince Young. Jersey. I said Jimmy. Was he on a Madden cover? Vince Young? Yeah. Nice. He sure was. That's it. What's up? What's up? What's I think, up? I think we are all caught up. Okay. So I think now is a good time to have a quick discussion about uh, Slime asks about minis. Let's do it. So we are very prepared to release our mini helmet series for tonight. In terms of boxes are in the room, we brought some in the room, we have the listings created. We just wanted to touch base on a couple things before we made that mini helmet series live. Chris, I'd like you to chime in with me when you can. Uh, we're going to see, you know, a lot of stuff in the industry is changing. Autographs are more expensive. Supplies are more expensive. Even, like, blank helmets are more expensive. Yeah. You know what I mean? So we will be seeing a change in price for our staple boxes, black box jerseys, black box minis the platinum helmets, and the uh, black box full-size helmets, we're going to see a little bit of, a, of an influence in price regarding how the industry is kind of going. Um, how can I get that helmet on the desk? Let me let me answer that in just a moment. So we're going to post our new minis uh, with our new format. They're going to be 38 a spot for the double box 39, breaks. 39. 39 a spot. I apologize. 39 a spot. And then they're going to go up to 129 retail on the website. So just a, a small 
kind of price change there, but it's just so we can cooperate with the changing market almost. And, you know, we've tried to put this price increase off as long as we can, but, you know, yeah, things are kind of getting, and even like, like supply and like shipping is even higher we've, than it's And we've been. done a good job controlling what we can control. Mm -hmm. um, what it's come down to, though, is uh, the industry's changed. Rookies this year are much more than last year's rookies. Uh, the number one reason for this is is just the the demand. you know the demand for for autographs is at a, a pretty high level and the the cost of uh, signatures that's the number one reason that this has gone up. But you know we've we've hauled off. We've never had a price uh, never we changed price since 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 the live break room. Yeah. So um, over a year. You know we just want to keep things rolling and we want to bring the best product to the break room. So. You know, we're going to make adjustments uh, along with the industry. So, nothing, nothing crazy, yeah, but uh, major, right? No, nothing major. But we are going to post that new mini tonight, and then uh, all the current breaks that are up will not have a update in price. Um, we were going to wait to do this uh, next week, but we want to get the minis out. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, starting with the next black box, starting with the next platinum, um, that's when you'll start to see that. But uh, we got the new mini up for tonight. Yep. Let me answer a couple questions here while we broke it down. Uh, again, if there's any questions about that, we'll be free to answer them the best I can. Uh, Aiden said, "How can I when when you get a second chance? When you get a second, can I see the Megatron jersey? Absolutely, I'll grab that in just a moment for you." Uh, it's DJ Dotty seven 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 says, "How can I get that helmet on the desk?" Uh, that is our Dutch auction item for the night. It will decrease in price every ten minutes. Uh, just try to get it before someone else does. That's our only item. There is a small defect on the item on the decal and can be totally swapped out and made look perfect. Um, plus you had to pay for Garrett's birthday party. That's very true. Uh, <laughs> Travis said, hey, a gallon of milk has gone up 20%. You guys need to too. It's just it's just how the market, so Chris brought up a good thing with rookies and stuff. Uh, to give you know an example, this rookie class was probably the most expensive Not in even. terms of autographs that we had ever seen. Not even close. And it Not was, even. I mean, the number one pick last year uh, you know, Joe Burrow wasn't even close in price to like the tenth pick. This late, year. right? Yeah. Late, late first round picks this year. So it's just, you know, it's just how the, how the industry is moving. So the the minis are posted. Uh, they are called the Stat Stuffer Minis. Awesome helmets, as the as the headliners: Calvin Johnson, Dan Marino, Drew Brees, John Elway, Matt Ryan, Joe Montana, Jerry Rice, Duel, Sean Alexander. Throwback. First time I've seen Sean Alexander in here in a while. That's uh, pretty cool. Another Madden, Madden guy. Yeah, another Madden guy, an Alabama guy. Alabama. Heisman Trophy winner in Alabama. One of the best running backs that I watched. He won the Heisman? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That. Well, now I do. I suppose you learn something new every day. I believe you did. The more you know. Suppose I think he did. I'm not going to, you know. Inflation has to make changes for all businesses. That's the way it goes. That's the way the cookie crumbles. We appreciate kind of like the positive. Yeah. We, we worked really there, hard yeah. not to the last, because this has been to talk since the first of the year, so we, we yeah. really scaled back on what we could control, and you know, we want to, uh, the biggest thing is we want to be the best break room, but we need the best product, and so we're going after some bigger names. You'll yeah. see some cool stuff this fall, new releases, new new stuff <clears> that's going to get people involved, and um, you know, it's going to be a good time this, this football season. Yeah, and another thing too, if I may just hash on one more thing, uh, something that's brand new for our breaker room are the Diamond Series boxes. Yeah. And I mean, that's super high end stuff, and we want to continue that series. I think that's super successful, and that's fun stuff to break. So that's something we want to do too that diamond, those high end stuff, the cool giveaways that we can do. Um, let me show Aiden his trick in here. And again, guys, it is customer appreciation week, so every spot you purchase. Gets you into a top spot giveaway for a Devontae Adams autographed full-size helmet. That will be giveaway. That will be tonight. That's a giveaway for tonight. tonight. Giveaway for tonight. Aiden, there you go, my man. Congrats on the hit. Kind of show up and say, hey, what did I miss? You missed that. And this is exactly what you missed. So let's get an update as to where we're at. 
I can read off can read off hold on a second read off what we have available so we have the pitch and catch number three posted that's got eight spots remaining we have eight spots left in the 4th of July Authentic, six spots in the Luxury Lids Black Box Helmet Series, seven spots in the Diamond Helmet Series, six spots in the Stat Stuffer Double Box Break, nine spots left in the Mega, Spo Mega Box Jersey, nine spots in the 4th of July Mixer, six spots in the Deflate Crate, and the uh, Triple Break Mixer, ten spots left. Break down what that means quickly. It's a 4th of July Authentic, a Luxury Lid. The lighting is dimming slowly in here. <laughs> I can tell like the color of the mat is like a different color than that. Oh, it's wow. we just lost the light. slowly doing, yeah. Um, I don't know how to change the light bulb. I do, <laughs> but I'm, you know, it's not it's, my thing. It's not your department. Mm -mm. We'll take, we'll, we'll get somebody to take care of that for you, Donnie. Thank you. You're welcome. I need it done within the next hour. Travis says you, oh. We are not. That should not be charging shipping. Hold on one second. <laughs> no, we're not charging shipping. Mm -mm. No, uh, no shipping. Hold on just a second. Let me fix that for you. Travis, only for you, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Travis, I can refund you that shipping if you bought a break spot and got charged for shipping. No, I saw thirty-two dollars in shipping and took a pause. Good job. <laughs> Good job. Yeah, that's smart. Guys, we're actually gonna fill up that first double box break too, pretty quickly, if I may add. Thank you guys for the support on that. Put the link in the chat for our first uh, mini break for the night. Thirty-nine bucks a spot gets you a double box break entry. Um. What else? That, that's about it, right, Chris? That's Chris. it. That's it. We'll uh, be ready to go for football season. Yeah. we got some cool stuff coming out later this week, though. Stat stuffer, four spots left in that first one. Yeah, we're working really hard to get some new stuff posted for this weekend, uh, like a basketball mixer, a baseball mixer. Baseball only. Yeah. The mini break showing a shipping choice. I just took that off. I just took that off. So we should be good there. Travis, Danny Hunter, Chris Brown. There we go. Just took the shipping off. Chris. What's up? What's your favorite Chris Brown song? Were you a Chris Brown fan? Nah, not really. You don't like his music? I don't know the last time I heard a Chris Brown song. It's probably like one of his first albums. Probably like hmm. 10, 10 years ago. Wow. Longer than that. Probably longer, yeah. Like I remember listening when, to Chris Brown when I was like in 8th grade. I was like, like 14. <laughs> like 2010. So maybe like 12 to 15 years ago. Yeah, that's that's probably the last I really listened to Chris Brown. Yeah. Give me that. Ooh, yeah. Me that, like around there. Mm-hmm. Chris well, Brown says... What was the one with, uh, like, Jays on Saturday? Gotta have them and I just can't wait. What song was that? Like, Jays on Saturday. Gotta have them and I just can't wait. That, that, that was it. Chris Brown, with, with you? Yeah. That was probably... 
the last time I listened to Chris Brown. With you, I think it is. I'm not a big music guy, though. No, you're not. You're an audible book guy, right? Like, when you're in the car, you listen to books. I listen to books, or I listen to uh, podcasts. Screamo. What? What's Screamo? Screamo music. What? You lost me? You never heard of Screamo music? You have. I don't think I've listened to it. You probably never listened to it, but you know that there's a genre. What's Screamo? See, I'm I'm not a music... (laughs) I mean... (laughs) Okay, well, if that's what it is, I've probably heard it. But, yeah, no, I'm, I'm not a big... Heavy uh, metal, scary as hell. Like, some be like, what's your favorite song? I'd be like, the other thing I'm really bad at is music lyrics. No! I don't know any of them. <sighs> really bad. This is a good question from Jay. Never a stupid question. How can you be guaranteed to win something? Well, <laughs> My now... Response. Now, you can't really be guaranteed to win if you buy less than eight spots. Like, you can't... And the, or you could buy a personal box where you buy all the spots or where you buy off the mystery box tab and you get to pick whatever box number you'd like to open it for you on the screen. But yeah, we, there's no... If you buy one spot, you're never guaranteed to win as much as we like to guarantee everybody's a winner. Man, I think that the mini just filled up. Yeah, I got another the second one already listed. All right. Oh, I gotta finish. Sorry, dude. I forgot to do that one part. All right. Kind of important. All right, all right, all right. My favorite Chris Brown song is Yo. Yo? Yo is a banger. <laughs> Absolute banger. <laughs> I don't know your name, but excuse me, miss. I saw you from across the room. Man, Chris Brown used to have some bangers. Does he still come out with them? He, I believe so. All right. All right, let me get that done. I don't know your name, but excuse me, miss. I saw you from across the room. Took about five minutes ago. Who hit on the live break number one full size black box series? That was Luxury Lids. That was Robert B. He hit a Rodney Hampton New York Giants. Rodney Hampton. You played, he had a cup of coffee with the Bears. <laughs> he was there for like four he had games. A, he had a cup of coffee. He had a cup with of the, coffee that's with awesome. Bears. I, lo- I really like that. I'm not going to lie to you. <laughs> that's great. All right, that list is getting updated by Chris. You're good. I'll move it over. Okay. No trouble. <laughs> See, me and you can go back and forth on movies, though. Oh, yeah. Uh, I think I think anybody here at Ultimate, nobody goes back and forth on it. Yeah. Better than you and I. That's a fact. People are like, what are they talking about? We got O-I-F-X-N-R-I-R-I. What? Do you know what that is? That username? Can you put the full name in the chat? I F X N R I. I th- I might have missed his comment. O H P. Never mind. Oh. Oh. Did oh. we already do luxury lids? Or has it not filled up? Oh, we did. We did. I'm sorry, I missed that one. Luxury oh. lids. We did. That was the black box helmet. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Very midwestern of you. Oh. <laughs> That's like a midwestern thing. Is it? Yeah. Oh. This is me leaving. This is me leaving. This is me leaving. This is me leaving. Old school reference, see? You can go right, right, right into the movies. Movies are fun to reference. This is me leaving. <laughs> that's like not even a major part of that movie either. No, that's like, the, why do you remember that part? It's so, so good. It's really funny like, the ones you remember. <laughs> this is me leaving. Here we go, four and seven for the stat stuff for mini helmet break. Double box. Double box break. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. Ultra What? What was I doing? Oh, yeah. Here we go. Uh, Katrina says, post a quad mini, you know it will fill. Katrina, we have anybody else in for a quad mini? If you guys want to do a quad mini, let us know in the chat. We can get that posted. We have a second 
stat stuff for right now. Oh, All the right. title says triple helmet mixer. What? You screwed up, Chris. No, I didn't. It's on there. Stat stuff for mini. No, I know, but the top where the big bold white letters are? Yeah, I didn't do that part. <laughs> this is right. This is the right list. This is me leaving. This is this the right list? Yeah, that's the right list. Okay. Right list for stat stuff for mini. This is what it's supposed to be. We've already randomized. We're good to go. This is me leaving. <laughs> All right, guys. Best of luck. Let's do it. Stat stuff for mini number one. It is wide receiver for the New York Giants. Wow. Full size bag with the mini. Well, I hope they're not all like that. No, they're not. Thank God. Sterling Shepard. Sterling Shepard. <laughs> I think it's like the first 40. I'm just kidding. What is a quad mini? A quad mini is a four box break. Four box break. We got two people in for a quad. What do you think, Chris? Maybe after the double fills, we'll post a four box break? Yes, we will do that. We got a personal, too. Uh, let's see. Our coffee stain. Brad, do you... I don't see that marked as on open on sure. camera. Well, Brad, you, they can't anymore. It's not on the website. Oh, Brad, do you want... If you're in the chat, do you want that open uh, <laughs> live? I think that's a... No trouble. <laughs> <laughs> no trouble. Not quite my tempo. Yeah, but, like, the website right now is not showing the open live off. Yeah, no, we got to... About it last week. It's, uh, it's Brad does want it open line. Brad, do you want to give us a box number for your personal? And he wants number 33. Chris, can you put 33 in the tab there? Sure. Sure. Next one. This is uh, Snow coming up on his second year in the league. A couple nice games last year. Could be a decent option for Derek Carr. This is his... Wow, that's a cool mini. Oh, my. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. So much bag. This is a South Carolina Gamecock. This is a really cool mini. Carolina, South Carolina Gamecocks mini. Look at that. It's pretty cool. Oh, that is nice. It's like an alternate... This goes to the AFC West wide receiver, Brian Edwards. Brian Edwards is a Raiders wide receiver. Could be a nice little second-year option for the Raiders. A couple good games last year for him. Kevin Malloy. Uh, Chris, you're the only behind-the-scenes guy that uses three screens. I like it. I like it. What can I say? I have nothing to say. What can I say? I save the day, I guess. We need to... <laughs> Sorry, I was reading something. There's so much. <laughs> Chris Bartletto wants a trade for that. See, there's a hit out there for everybody. Chris, what's next to fill? What's the closest thing? We got four spots left in the stat stuff mini. Eight, seven spots in the diamond. Nine spots in the mega jersey mixer. Brady still available in the mega mix? Yeah. Brady's still available. Brady, that's a licensed jersey. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Flag Day Authentic is open. Fourth of July Mixer, nine spots left. Deflate Crate, it's got six spots left. Pitch and Catch number three, he's got eight spots left. And Luxury Lids number two has five spots left. And we also have uh, ten spots left in our Triple Helmet Mixer. So lots to, a lot of options tonight. After we fill this this mini LV, I will list a quad. Oh, all right. I will list a quad. 
If I buy a pitch and catch box, can you open it on stream? We absolutely can. We absolutely can. Those are going to be $149.99 for the autographed jersey series. You want to go ahead and buy that and uh, let us know what box number you'd like. You get your entire pick of the litter. This is a personal for Brad Egger. Eager? Is it Eager Brad? Like Eager Beaver? Or is it Egger like... You don't li uh, like her? Let's Egger. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce it. Egg. You know? Or you can just say egg. Like, if you don't like her, egg her. I don't think you need to do that. I don't need to egg anybody. She broke your heart? Egg her. Have you ever egged something? I have not egged. You never egged someone's house? No. I've, I've been egged. Really? Car. A long time ago. Did you deserve it? Apparently. <laughs> I don't know who did it. Apparently. That was a long, long time ago. Brad, here we go. Good luck. I don't know. Is it hard to clean off? I don't know. I just went to a car wash. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't hard for them. <laughs> All right, Brad. You're going to like this one, man. This is really, really good. This guy was really good in college. Eggs are horrible on a car. Dissolves paint. There you go. This is a really, really good mini, though. Super Bowl champ. Stud in, in college. First round draft pick. He was number five. Devin White. Tampa Bay Buccaneer linebacker. Devin White. That's a nice pull, Brad. Really, really good player. It's really good. He's also a big-time horseback rider. Equestrian? He was a big equestrian, yeah. There he is. Did you know that? I did not know that. LSU, Louisiana State University. Chris, we did one diamond break. We pulled uh, Derek Brooks Speed Authentic with an inscription. Uh, Jay likes it. Yeah, I like the LSU minis. These are, these are really cool. These is real nice. Don't it's real know. nice. Got it at Target. Go ahead. <laughs> are you uh, are you a college football fan? Yeah. Who's your college football team? I don't have a team that I like. I suppose that I just like to watch college football. Does that make sense? Yeah. I like to watch the playoff. I like to follow the guys that are going to be drafted. If I had to choose a team from the beginning of the year to win the championship that I would cheer for... I don't know. I don't honestly don't. I'm not. Because you didn't go to a college. No, not like a big name school. I went to D3, Benedictine University. I mean, I guess U of, U of I? No. I don't no. really care about their football team. They stink. Northwestern, maybe. That would be pretty cool. Not a Northwestern fan? Maybe, maybe Northwestern because they're so local. Maybe. I like Pat Fitzgerald. To the coach? Yeah, I like that show a lot. I know they have that awesome skills or strength coach that wears like the tight polos in the snow and slaps people on the head. What? He like headbutts players. <laughs> He's a psycho. Do we fill up that stat stuff for number two? Yeah. Sweet. Let's make the next one a quote. Uh, All right, listed. <laughs> Chris, you were in that break. It was not you, however. You had the AFC North. You were looking for some Steelers hits, Ravens, Browns, Bengals. Pulled the South. Quad is up. Quadrina, it is posted. The four, seven. We need a double box break here. Look to protect your neck. Garrett Bartels. Oh. And one. There we go. One and six for our double box break. Thanks, guys, for another fill on the minis. Going to continue to drop this A.J. Brown down in price. A.J. Brown's at 390 bucks. All right, here we go. One and six, Chris. 
What'd you say? One in six. Mm -hmm. I'm about to sneeze. Bless you. Oh, I think I messed the price up. One fifty six for the quad. <laughs> <laughs> That would be an eight box. That'd right? be an eight box. Now let me fix it. Katrina, only one fifty six for you. Everybody else is seventy eight. <laughs> You're like, why isn't anyone jumping in on this? Why? You guys said you wanted it. <laughs> Fine. All right, I'll fix it. There we go. One and six. I'll fix it. Alright, here we go. This guy is ASU, Arizona State guy. Keep all the NFC East hits going. How about another one? How about a Dallas Cowboy? Alright, who bagged these? Someone's getting fired in here. I think I bagged those. Who is using these full size helmet boxes? Come on. This goes to Garrett Bartels, Darren Woodson, defensive player for the Cowboys. There you go, Garrett. Take that. That's a good hit. Good hit, good hit. G-A-R-R-E-T. -T. Two E. Two T's. Both Garrett's at work here have one T. Well, together they have two T's. Correct. That is correct. That's a good point. Another hit for the NFC East. Hot tonight for the Giants and the Cowboys. All right. We're all correct on our minis. Katrina, pricing is correct on the minis now. Next one, number six. I would love to have something signed by Khalil Mack. Mini college home. That would be pretty cool. Uh, Memphis, right? Buffalo. 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 Memphis. Nope. Buffalo, oh, Buffalo, yes. Buffalo. Buffalo. He doesn't sign that much. Doesn't sign at all. This is a stat stuffer. Oh. So much so that he has a headliner. Look at the photo. <laughs> ain't gonna stop him. What you gotta do? You gotta do what you gotta do, right? He's saying ain't gonna stop him. <laughs> How about this one? How about the stat stuffer himself? A headliner pull for the AFC East. Going to Aiden Sabatinelli, who's having himself quite the night here in the UA Live Breaks. Dan Marino. Dan Marino. I like that. Uh, he's rocking the mask and face protection in the photo. Hey, I'm doing this signing. COVID signings 2020. People want my autograph. That's. I guess that's what you got to go through when people want your autograph. Thanks, thanks for doing that, Dan. Dan. Dan the man. Dan Marino, Dolphins Mini. Aiden, I'm pulling you fire. Tip jar is wide open. <laughs> Aiden, we accept everything from $5 tips to $1,000 tips. Just to put that in your head space. Your air space. Head space? Head space. It's a great hit. Dan Marino. Dan the man who never won a Super Bowl who also went to hell in Little Nicky. He's been in a lot of movies. Bruce Almighty. First one. Bad Boys 2. Ace Ventura. Ace Ventura, that's right, not Bruce Almighty. What was the second mini here? The other one was a Darren Woodson. Darren Woodson Cowboys mini. Was about five minutes ago. All right, let's see how we're doing in here. Quad is filling up fast. Wow. Katrina, Micah, Brandon, Connor, Nestor, and Robert. What did Robert snag here? Robert got himself a personal and a quad spot. There we go, Robert. I'm going to 
fast as we can. Five, six, seven spots taken. Someone's going to close it out. I think someone just closed it out. Chris Wells, close it out. Let's go. That's nice. quick. That's a quick quad filler. I think we're going to do another quad. We're going to do another quad. We're going to do another quad. Let's do another quad. One more. Qu another quad. I'll get you updated, and then I will get a quad posted shortly. Yeah, Roberts. Uh, I already put it in there. Yeah, right. Oh yeah. Slow with the Dutch. Just I literally just did it. Okay. Fine. Be that way. Just want to do it again. Yeah, sure. Fine. Three seventy nine. This loaded to three eighty a minute ago. Now it's at three seventy five. Hey Jay, if you want to open up a personal box, my man. Uh, I'm going to put the link to the Mystery Boxes tab on the website. All the boxes have the pricing on the website right now. Depends on what you are into, honestly. All right, let's get that. So we have one, two, and we don't have one. We have six. All right, we're going to run the last four here. We got two, three, five, and eight. And I got to get some more box numbers for the quad. Two, three, five, and eight. Was about five minutes ago. All right, four boxes. Gonna grab some more boxes for the next couple minis that we post. Chris, how we doing? You're good to go. Good to go. All right, let's do it. Guys, thank you very much for the fill on the next mini. Chris, thanks for getting that list updated so quickly so these guys can break. Number four is going live in 30 seconds. Make it 25. Okay, 25. All right, fine. 40. Mm hmm? All right, here we go. So Bob said, I've been lucky with Giants tonight. How about a Danny Dimes and an LT? <laughs> Let's see what we got. Five, we got two, three, five, and eight. Two, three, five, and eight. Slime, never seen an Eli. Honestly, we haven't either. To be honest, I mean, e sign. Eli's a guy who never signs either. Eli Manning. I'm, I think he might be a Steiner guy, no? Steiner is owned by Fanatics now, so he's probably a Fanatics guy. I would guess so, because Aaron Rodgers used to be Steiner. Got bought out by Fanatics. It's a good start to the quad. Kevin Malloy with a personal. We got a Colts defensive lineman, absolute stud. Robert Mathis. Robert Mathis going to the AFC South for box one in Micah Gregory. Kevin Malloy says, missed out on the quad, so I bought a personal. Well, you can't lose that way. Mike Man. Gregory, nice pull there. You pick your box. True. That's Mathis. Can you put him down for number 14, please? 14. Sure. Oh, Brandon Steiner's got a new company. That's pretty cool. Probably still don't have one with Mountain back in the day. What? Shorts. What? Nothing. I'm good. No. Talk about Mountain Memories. Hidden Collectible Exchange. Is that his no. new company? No, that's, yeah, that's his new company. All right, here we go. Connor Kimball says, I'm always getting the AFC North. I'm a Titans fan. <laughs> and we have, a we have this Dutch auction for tonight, slowly lowering in price. 
Next hit is a Green Bay Packer mini. And it's Alan Lazard. Who's got the North Chris Wells in the North? An NFC North hit. Christopher Wells takes the Alan Lazard slot receiver, second receiver for the Packers. What's up? Nothing. I keep saying something and then answering my question, so. Okay. We're good. Okay. Remember, guys, all of our UA Live breaks come with third party. Third. <laughs> that sounded so Canadian. Third party authentication. Minnesota. E. E. e? Guy's a bender. E. We could bender over here. Oot in a boot in a boat in Minnesota. Part of me wishes I was from Canada, Chris. And I don't know why. <laughs> I just want to be included, you know? You're so, included here. a relatively unpopular division is doing pretty well in this uh, quad box mini break. The AFC South with another pull. Mark Brunel on a chrome. That's a nice pull right there. Mark Brunel on the chrome mini. Going to Micah G yet again. There you go, Micah. Oot in a boot in a boot in Minnesota. How about that? No. You ever been to Minnesota? Uh, I have been to Minnesota. Did you stay there for a long time? No. I was there for like four hours. You're just driving through Minnesota? Went to a Nike outlet. That was it. Really? Yeah. Clear for what story. reason? a shop? Yeah. No tax. No in Minnesota? Tax, no tax, and it was one of the few Nike clearance stores. So there's like Nike Inline, Nike Factory, and then Nike Clearance. What's Nike Inline? So like your Michigan Avenue store, your stuff that's brand new, full price. And they had it for a deep discount? Yeah, so this was a clearance store. So it was like, yeah. That was a while ago. But yes, yeah, probably the only time I've been in Minnesota. Was it worth it? Nah. It's a good day trip, though. You ever been to Canada? Never been to Canada. You want to go? Uh, maybe one day. I don't even think we're allowed there right now, though. Really? I think the border's still closed. Well, I think you're right. It's a good pull. I'm very big on this guy for this upcoming season. Slime says, do you like Drake and Bare Naked Ladies and Michael Buble? Hell yeah. All of the three? Hell yeah. Aiden with a great comment. Donnie, I started buying into breaks a year ago yesterday. Oh, congratulations. Congrats, Aiden. Glad to have you. Aiden, you hit something tonight, too, I think. Nice little one-year anniversary gift. This is a nice pull. Denver Broncos, Cortland Sutton. Cortland Sutton, the banger. Nice pull. Border's still closed unless you're a semi-truck driver. Which I am not. Which we are not. It's my dad, maybe. Your dad drives a semi driver? Not a semi. It's called a straight truck. A what? Straight truck. What's that? It's like not as big as a semi. Okay. Mm. 26 footer? I don't know. Looks big. All right. Corlin Sutton. Nice. What if you have to drive to Alaska? Can you drive to Alaska? Is there? Yeah, like what if you did have to drive to Alaska? Like, hey, I have to get to Alaska. I'm sure there's. That's a great question, Slime. I mean, who wants to drive to Alaska, dude? Not this guy who hates the cold. That's stuff for four. Sold out. Wow. What do you think? Another quad or we'll go double? Quad it is. Actually. We'll 
put in the quad. What's wrong with the quad? What's up, Luigi, man? Good to see you. Haven't seen Anthony Luigi in a while. Welcome back. What are we got? Welcome back. Welcome back. 9, 10, 11, 12, 14, 15. What's up, boar? Moved in, down, in the unit. New unit, new state. Bad spelling. Whole lot going on right there, <laughs> Luigi. Not gonna lie to you. Is this a uh, good to delete this next to this division? What do you mean? Yeah, you can delete those. Sorry. All right. I was a little confused. Confuzzled. Welcome back. Oh, 14 is yours. Alright. We are good. Are we good? Alright, so we got personal for Rob, Robert, Bobby, your slime. Uh, the f you got 44, Kevin's got 14. Let's rip another quad and then we'll do some personals. How's that sound? Yeah, yeah, yes. Was it good? Number five is up. Another quad. For stat stuffer. Statistician stuffer. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Oh, there we go. All right, guys. Best of luck. Here we go. Let's see what we got. Quad. Do we have box numbers? Do we have box numbers, Chris? Nope. Not yet. Tell you what Garrett does. Give me a box. <laughs> we have 9, 10, 11, 12, and 13. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 15. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 15. Welcome back. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. The more you buy in, the better chance for that Devontae Adams. True. That's a nice helmet for a uh, giveaway. Yep. You're going to play anyways. Sell the, we could sell them out. Let's sell out the staff, staff stuffers tonight. Post a 40 box break. 40 box break. <laughs> All right, 11, 12, 13, 14. 11, 12, 13, 14. 11, 12, 11. 13, 15. 11, 12, 13, 15. You got it. Devontae Adams is a full size. Full size rep. Donnie, the Devante? Yeah, full size replica. Right. We'll be giving that away at the end of the show tonight. Donnie, I need to get a Johnny Bench MLB ball. Can you help? I can't really help. Uh, Do we have anything in ours? I don't know. I don't know. 11, 12, 13, 15. There we go, guys. Best of luck. Let's see what we got access to. Check our website. We may have one up on the website. Johnny Bench. Johnny Bench, the catcher who can hold seven baseballs in his hand at one time. All right, here we go. The only thing is that Johnny Bench jersey. All right. That'll work. All right, we may need a... Uh, what do we got on this guy here? What do you got? We have an Alabama Crimson Tide. Chris, I may need his longest, I may need his longest tenure from you. Alabama Crimson Tide running back Darren Payne. Now, I want to almost guarantee myself and say that he played for the New York Giants for his longest tenure. I could be incorrect. This is a really cool mini. This is an Alabama. He's currently on the Washington football team. Is he? Yeah. Darren Payne? He's currently on the team. Okay, beautiful. We got an NFC East hit with the Washington football team. Darren Payne. 13th pick in the 2018 draft. Okay, cool. 
That's a nice Bama mini. I like that a lot. Nick Perrine. No, Nick. What position does he play? Is he a... What's he got? Defensive yeah. tackle. Ah. Okay, okay. I have the right division. See, I could have been totally wrong, and I still would have got the winner right. And that that's a good feeling. It's a good feeling. <laughs> that's the way to look at it. Sure. Shoot. Shoot. Welcome back. Johnny Bench, autographed baseball, huh? Johnny Bench, the best catcher of all time, Chris? Uh, he's, he's up there. I don't know if I could name that many more than him. That are Carlton Fisk, maybe? Carlton Fisk is very good. Carlton Fisk, maybe even... uh. Yogi Berra? Yadier Molina? Joe Maurer and Buster Posey? I don't know. Joe Maurer was pretty good. Joe Maurer is awesome. Speaking of Joe Maurer. Ivan Rodriguez, he was good. Speaking of Joe Maurer, we got a 2,000 yard rusher, Jamal Lewis. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing says 2,000 yard rusher like the Minnesota Twins. Backcatcher. Jamal Lewis. <laughs> nice hit for Luigi there. Chris, where did Jamal Lewis go to college? Tennessee. Tennessee. That's correct. Mario Kart. All right, were you a Mario Kart player? Yeah. Who, who did you use? Uh, you, uh, you were a Toad guy. No, I was like a Baby Mario, Baby Yoshi guy because I thought they were faster because they were smaller. Uh, Which has not been proven to be correct. No. But they are fast. Yeah. Uh, Toad was fast. I was a Yoshi guy. Yeah? Yeah. Why is that? Why did you just bring that up? Luigi. Oh, of course. I don't, cause I don't know if anybody's ever used Luigi. Does anybody use Luigi in Mario Kart? No, I, I, I don't think so. No, not really. It's a fun name. Speaking of Joe Maurer. <laughs> come on. Speaking of Joe Maurer, we have Denver Broncos throwback defensive player, Carl Mecklenburg. Boy, that is a lot of rap for us, mini helmet. Carl Mecklenburg. <laughs> the Ring of Fame. That goes to Nathaniel Thomas. If Deflate Crate doesn't sell out, do we still get a spot in the Devontae helmet? Absolutely. Yes. Absolutely. You are in. All right, Mec. Dutch auction down to 360. Did you just drop it? I did. I certainly did. There we go, Nathaniel. Maurer had a full ride to be quarterback at Florida State and took the money to be the number one overall draft pick by his hometown twins. That was probably a good decision. It, it panned out. It worked out for him. Carl Mecklenburg, Denver Bronco mini. He's in the Broncos ring of fame. Quadrina not doing well in the quads today. Quadrina, very happy that you snagged that Darius Leonard earlier, by the way. That's an awesome piece. Hopefully it looks great in your collection. But here we go. Last one. Stat Stuffer Mini. That's it. Well, this is awesome. Former Florida Gator. Danny Warfel. How'd you know? Javon Curse. Javon Curse, AFC South for Danny Hunter. 
Daniel Hunter, 633. 5-8 Javon Curse. That's a beautiful, beautiful mini. The Freak indeed. You watch him a lot? Who? Javon Curse? Do I watch him a lot? Like, did you? I feel like when he was in his prime, you must have been a big football guy. Uh, I mean, I watched all football. He was, he was, he was good. I wouldn't say like, oh, I gotta go watch Javon Curse. Well, he was also a defensive player on a team that you weren't familiar with, probably. Yeah, I didn't watch a lot of Tennessee. Tennessee. Yeah, I figured you didn't. No. Say that he was awesome, man. Yeah, I did. I'm agreeing with you. <laughs> is he all? He's not a Hall of Famer, though. Uh, Paul is very good. Donnie, have you ever heard of John Fitzgerald? I've heard of F. Scott Fitzgerald. Great Gatsby. Jay Soren said, "It's funny. I remember watching Javon Curse and Jeremiah Trotter on Extreme Dodgeball on the on the Game Show Network." <laughs> I just watched a... Uh... Oh, he's crying. Oh, man. I apologize. I like it, though. I like that you're into it. You're watching the Tennessee Titans hits coming through. <laughs> I know why the minis are more expensive than the huge bags. That's <laughs> <laughs> exactly right. Giant bags for the minis. Unbelievable. They go back to normal size. They better. <laughs> All right. Oh, we got. Hang on, I gotta get caught up here. Sweet. Uh, da, 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 da. Here we go again. I feel the chemicals are kicking in. Oh, 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 choo choo. <laughs> Michael McDonald during allergy season. All right. Donnie, we sold out another quad. Okay. Drop that down, maybe back to maybe double. I don't know. Double, double. I want anybody. Quad or double? Let's let the chat decide. For a sixteen boxer. Sixteen boxers. We can do another quad. You guys, let us know what you want for the next break. Minis. Yeah. Stat stuff. Yeah. Fill up another quad, huh, Chris? Fill up another quad. Katrina going for the closer magic. Which is a thing in the break room. It is a thing. It is a thing. The closer magic. So stats stuff for mini number five, right? That is correct. That is correct. You let me know when the green sheet's ready and we'll rip another break. All right, so let me do a quick personal. Do a quick personal. Yeah, personal for Bob. He's got number 44. And you can get caught up on your list. Sure. All right. Sixteen bucks for the price of a double. Exactly. All right, Robert. Time for your personal mini box number forty-four. Let me show you that number again. Forty-four of fifty. You pick the box number, and it is. Wow. On a team that we haven't seen in ages in here. Actually, you know what? He may have just left the team this off season. I know he's a Notre Dame fighting Irish. He did just leave. I think he went to the Dolphins. Dude, I tell you what, we haven't had. I thought it was Texans. He was on the Texans last season. Injured, injury prone guy, but a big time wide receiver. Will Fuller. 
Will Fuller, play like a champion today. Will Fuller, Notre Dame mini. Did he go to the Dolphins? I believe he went to the Dolphins. Did he go to the... Yeah. I want to say he went to the Dolphins. Check out that bag size. The what? Check out the bag size. There you go. It was box number 44 <laughs> with the regular bag. My goodness, that is going to be a struggle. There we go. Ah, I listed a quad. That's okay. Nah, I'm just saying. That's what I went with. Okay. Maybe I'll list a double, too. Don't do that. Then they can pick. Nope, 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 nope. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, yeah, I will. Oh, he's a Dolphin now. Cool. So he's on the Miami Dolphins now. Thought it was a Texan for a second. I got excited. We don't see a ton of Texans. You know why, though? Because Texans need the team. Like, and there's no incredibly desirable Texans. Well, J.J. Watt just left. Yeah, right. Hopkins yeah. Left. Like, Deshaun Watson is not desirable anymore. No. Simone Biles. Dates a guy in the Texans. Who? Don't even know his name. He's tall, though. And she's four foot nine. Remember, like, the Texans' history, too, is this Yeah, thing. exactly. Right now, the best player on the roster is... Dude, I know Andre Johnson would be awesome, but he's a guy well, who he's never, he's a, never he's signs. He's probably the best in history there. Yeah, he never Him signs. And yeah. And then you have, like, Arian Foster, who was really oh, good yeah, for them. Arian Foster had a, Matt was Schaub good. was a good quarterback for them. However, Texans players don't sign. I don't know what it is about Texans players. Who else is another famous Texan? What about Gas Mask Laramie Tunsil? <laughs> uh, probably not a very desirable guy. And I don't. Oh, yeah, the Dolphins traded him to the Texans for like their third overall pick. Laramie Tunsil. Gas Mask. All right, Kevin Malloy, time for his personal. Of 50. Oh, baby! Yeah! Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Sorry, I just got super excited. I'm excited. Kevin Malloy says, leave box 14 number for me. Leave me box 14. We did. And I think you're going to like it. Not one, but two of the best football players of all time on the Ooh. same dang mini. Jerry Rice, Joe Montana, Riddell Eclipse mini helmet. Let's go. That's, that's a good personal. That's a beautiful personal. That's a dub. That's a dub. Sheesh. You want to do it? Pretty fun. Do what? Sheesh. I will leave that to you. Does Gabriel do it? He will. If you show him, he will. I know. <laughs> that is an amazing mini helmet break. One of the biggest, if not the biggest, mini helmet headliner. Still got Drew Brees. That is special right there. Jerry Rice, Joe Montana, Duel, Eclipse. Banger. Kevin, congrats, my man. And that was because he didn't get in the quad. He said, I just bought myself a personal. I just want the box. Not too a shabby. If I may say so. Pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. All right, best Texans lists. You have, here's some names. J.J. Watt, Andre Johnson, DeAndre Hopkins, Arian Foster, Brian Cushing. I mean, Deshaun Watson is Jonathan awkward. Joseph, Jadanian Clowney, Clowney, Dwayne Brown, Mario Williams, Kareem Jackson, Owen Daniels, DeMarco Ryans, Vince Wolf, Wolfork, Chris Myers, A.J. Boye, Lamar Miller, 
Will Fuller, Antonio Smith, Jacoby Jones, and Deshaun Watson run off the top 20, according to Ranker.com. Deshaun Watson is way better than all of those guys, to be very Match honest. who? Deshaun Watson. Match, yeah, but... Matt Schaub is 24th. I thought he'd be way higher. So did I. Owen Daniels? Tyron Matthew played there? I uh, did. Daniel Manning, Ed Reed? Ed Reed must have had a very short stint. Neil Rackers? David Carr? Man, David Carr would run for his life. Oh, damn it. I did something dumb. What'd you do? I need to go to the break. I hit the randomizer one too many times. So I will find the video and I will look at it for when it is nine times and type the list in. I'll show everybody that as I do it. Happens way more than it should. Right there. So Dave Harris, Nestor, Josh Tucker, Anthony L, Katrina P. I apologize, guys. Rookie. Rookie move, Chris. Fire this guy. That would suck if I got fired on a break. Donnie, I have something to tell you. Yeah. <laughs> that is so bad. But can you finish? You, you mind? Finish up the squad, then uh, pack up your shoot. All right, there we go. It is now correct. All right, guys, sorry about that. Just hit the randomizer one too many times, went back and fixed it. And there we go. Number six is listed as a quad. Right, Chris? Yes. It is. You need to hire me. Reach out to the two. Have some great ideas. I can come in as a consultant. Luigi wants to be a consultant for UA. All right, I got four boxes. 9, 10, 16, 17. Oh, did I not miss the six? I'm sorry. Hang on. What'd you do? What'd you do? They only had diesel. <laughs> they were all out. They only had diesel. 9, 10, 16, 17. Five is sold out. No six listed yet, Chris. It, it's, uh, it's gone. It's now. I had it on uh, standby. You fool. Look what you've done, you little jerk. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you do? What'd you do? <laughs> I forgot that line. Oh, we had diesel. They're all out. And we had diesel. That's when he's fighting with the door, and then he <laughs> yeah. rips the door off the car. First mini. So we got in this one. Perfect. Jacksonville Jaguar. Fred Taylor. Who's got the AFC South? Katrina. Hey, Katrina go. Perrine, not the AFC South team she wanted, but she'll take it. Fred Taylor on the Jacksonville Jaguars. This chair needs some WD-40. Really? I gotta start running. <laughs> there we go. Fred Taylor. Free rain jacket with every mini purchase. Free what? Rain jacket. Free rain. Free parka. Free poncho. Yeah, poncho. That's what I was. That's what I was doing. Oh yeah! All right, here we go. Next hit. Stats tougher. Next pull, is there a, I'll tell you. Next pull is a Andre Reed. Do we have an order number for Richard at Cook there? It doesn't have an order number on the green sheet. Did you just pop one in there? 
so I could write it down so we could find his order. There we go, Richard with the Andre Reed. AFC East pull. Here you go. Thank you, dude. Shoot. Seven one. There you go. Andre Reed Mini. I would like to touch the flat. Oh yeah. Look at you Hey, mucho te crisis. Next poll, we have a Hall of Famer. 11 time Pro Bowler. That's a pretty good stat for him. Ooh. <laughs> that thing's protected, though. Will Shields. Will Shields for the AFC West for Anthony. Luigi. There you go, Anthony. Three spots left in the quad. Number six. Flag day breaks Friday night. Yes, Bob. Yes, Bob. Thank you. Sorry, Chris. I didn't see that comment. I got you. Mr. I'll make a man out of you. What? Thoughts? Going to my pers first post-COVID concert tomorrow night. I think he said he was going to see Chicago. Oh, yeah? Are they still doing things? I guess they are. Saturday. Fourth and final mini for the quad. One of the band members had my favorite hot dog stand in college. Really? Yeah. Jamal Anderson. The Dirty Bird in the NFC South for Nestor Rodriguez. The Atlanta Falcons pull. What do you mean he had, his, you had your favorite hot dog stand? He had it? He owned it. It's called oh. Demon Dogs under the L at Fullerton next to DePaul University. And then the CTA. Was he ever there? I don't know. Who was it? I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's Bajan Martinson. Doesn't even sound like it existed. Demon Dogs. Demon Dogs. So good. Was it good? It was awesome. You get everything on it? Yeah, you just get it to Chicago one. Chicago one? Yeah. It's like hot dog, fry, and a drink, three bucks. That's it? That was beautiful. Beautiful for a college student. It was wonderful. Uh, Chicago Dog has tomato, sport peppers, mustard, onions, relish, That's no it. ketchup, celery salt, yes. and sport peppers. Yes. Sport peppers, tomato, celery salt, mustard, and relish. That sounds fantastic, right? Tyler Meeks says, is the Mega Jersey a double break? That's a good question. Yes. Yes, it is. All right, AJ Brown is down to 350. Let's do it. Is it closed? Wow, close it up. All right. Alright, let's see. 
squad six. All right, Donnie. All right. Let's run number six. Number seven is going up as a quad as well. Let's keep rolling. Let's keep the good times rolling. We still got good headliners, too. Okay, do 18, 19, 20, 21 for the next four. Wow. Sheesh! Yeah. Sheesh! Nope. All right, here we go. All right. Live break number seven. Stat stuff for mini quad. On a hot dog. Active. Where do you go for your hot dogs? Um. Where's Donnie go first? Hot dog. Portillo's isn't bad hot dog. I don't know. Just Portillo's? Just maybe, I don't know. I don't eat a ton of hot dog. Mm. Bone of beef? No. I think I'd rather go to Portillo's. Yeah. I don't, think I, I don't think I've had a bone of beef hot dog actually. No? Aiden uh, said, Donnie, pull me some more fire, so... No. No pressure. Aiden said, pull some more fire. Nah. <laughs> nope. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. All right, 18, 19. There some gloves. Better get the... Oh, Gene and Jews I've had. Gene and Jews. I haven't done Gene and Jews. Gene and Jews. Where's Gene and Jews? What town, I guess. I don't know. I, I don't know the town. It's really, really good, though. I can go for a gin and juice hot dog. That sounds... Bang! Kenny Moore! We want some more. Kenny Moore in the AFC South for Robert B. Slime hits a Colt. Kenny Moore, defensive player. One of the best catches of the year last year. One-handed interception. And a beauty. For my Colts. Na -na 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 -na. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We want some more. Kenny Moore. Where the hell is Gene and Jude's at? Why can't I think of Yeah, that? see Big Sammy's hot dogs. What's up? That's by up by us. Gabriel knows about that. Is that place good? It's real good. Who's Big Sammy? He's the guy that owns the joint. Gabriel the goat. <laughs> That's where me and Gabriel go. Big Sammy's. What's up, Gabe? Finish him. <laughs> Fatality. Flawless victory. Are you keeping up with that Devonta Adams list as well? Uh, huh? Yeah. One this guy's a tight end. Tight end, tight end hit. We got a Cowboys going to Brandon Chong. Jay Novacek. Tight end for Aikman, right? Yes, sir. Tight end for Aikman. Jay Novacek. Aikman, Irvin, Smith. Brandon Chong gets the Jay Novacek. Oh, those are some good teams. Oh, yeah. There we go. Six. That's hilarious. Oh. Been to a local chain called the Windmill here in Jersey. In line behind the boss. Gabriel, what you up to, man? When is like... Do you have like a lights out in your house at a certain time? Lights out? Yeah. Ah. Bedtime. 
Wind Shut it down. It's probably like wind down time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Summer's a little different. It's like school. Yeah, I get a more regiment. That's how my dad was too. Like, we didn't have like lights out, but he'd be like, "All right, that's enough." Yeah. <laughs> he'd be like, "Shut up." Oh yeah, River Grove. That's it. River that's where Gene and Juice. Lot. You can't get ketchup. They don't have. They don't let you get ketchup. Uh, the last it was Brandon Chong. We pulled another headliner out of this series. Another headliner hit. Jonathan Lang with the Calvin Johnson. Two Detroit counts. Lions. That's a beauty of a man. Two Calvin Johnsons tonight. What are the breaking ribbon? Two Calvin Johnson tonight. None, yeah. That's who. Pumped. Bang, 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 bang. Beauty. Johnny Lang, congrats, my man. I really want a hot dog. No tomato. No tomato? Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. You eat tomato on anything? No, I don't even need ketchup. Well, barbecue sauce. That's good. Does that come from tomato? I don't know. Better not? It does. It comes from a barbecue plant. Yeah, a barbecue plant. <laughs> the barbecue fruit. That was a nice pull. Yeah, congratulations. That's a good pull. It's always good to see a Calvin Johnson. Oh, it's good to see a headliner. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That was a good hit here. Another one of America's team's finest. Saw Jay Novacek. Now we have Mel Renfro, Hall of Fame 1996. Mel Renfro. Brandon Chong gets two. Chris Brown says ketchup, mustard, relish, nothing more. Nothing less. Ugh. No. But you don't put ketchup on it because you just don't like ketchup. You can't mix all three, though. It gets all soggy. You know? See, I think what makes a hot dog, it's got to have a good bun. If your bun's no good, it don't matter. Let me sure your bread is on point. Ugh. If you have too many liquids on there, put ketchup in the garbage. So do you, what do you eat fries with? Nothing. I eat the fries with the salt on the fries. You don't dip? Hell no. A little barbecue sauce. No. It ruins the fries. Ranch? It depends on the situation, I suppose. If ranch is ready available, maybe. Are you a mayo and fries mm -hmm. guy? Yeah, nah. Mm -hmm. Those people should go to jail. <laughs> <laughs> you got to go. <laughs> this is me leaving. <laughs> this is me leaving. This is me leaving. Katrina, also ketchup goes into the trash. Hell yeah. I like ketchup. Not, a, I don't know if, I mean... Ketchup and fries? Vinegar and fries? I'm more... That's yeah, probably the one, too. Vinegar? Vinegar and fries is a thing, isn't it? Probably. Yeah, vinegar and fries. Whoa. Oh, yeah. Tell you what, Chris. Oh. Alright, guys. Give it a few more minutes. See if we can fill up that next mini. What else we got? Still got to do the giveaway for Devontae Adams tonight. Six spots to go in the stat stuffer. Like I said, guys, we'll give it a few more minutes, see if we can close it out on a banger. We close on, I don't know if we're close on anything else, though. No, no, no unfortunately. Vinegar also goes in the trash. I, I'm just thinking I've ever eaten vinegar with fries in my life. I don't think I've been either. How about, like, uh, you eat fish? Uh, not a, not a big fish eater. I mean, I don't, like, go out and get it. I probably had fish like once in the last year. Really? That's it. Once a year? No seafood product. That's not that I don't. Oh, uh, well, seafood product. Shrimp. Yeah. A shrimp cocktail. Mmm. Wife, wife makes a good shrimp cocktail. Yeah. It's a labor of love. It's a, it's a of labor work. of love, it's baby. A lot of work. Brandon Chong is in on the mini. 
the labor of love. Close out one more mini. What do you say? Are you a fish eater? Ah. Uh, I prefer other stuff first. How many times have you had in the last year? Fish? A lot. My mom makes really good, uh, Whoa, Tyler Meek maybe just bought a personal here. Mega jersey. There you go, Tyler. You got it? Yeah, I can do that. Yeah. Katrina, I think we have six spots left in the mini. Five. But that one. <laughs> <laughs> not six. No, not six. Seven. <laughs> Seven, man. Seven's the key number. Seven little chipmunks on my uncle's branch. <laughs> you know the old tale from the sea. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, no, not, not six. Twenty-one for Tyler. Let me, six minutes. So let, let's do this. We'll rip the personal, and then we'll go right into that quad mini. So it'll sell out by the time the personal's done. Okay. I'm very confident. I'm very confident. Let's do it. If not, Chris will buy the rest of the spots. Chris Wells. <laughs> <laughs> I fixed his great cash, so you never know. Point. You did fix his UHS. It's fixed. <laughs> Five spots to go. So let's do this personal, and then we'll try to roll into that last squad mini for the night. And then we'll do our giveaway. You sweaty in here? It's a little warm in here. I can feel it on the neck, you know? Like right under here. All right, let me rip this personal for Tyler Meek. You know what I don't like to eat? What don't you like to eat, Donnie? Don't you wish your girlfriend What don't you like to eat? We can have 21. Chris, we may not have 21. We have 23, 26, 28, 29, 30. And up from there. 23, 26, 28, and then all the way up to 60. Yeah, Tyler, what he said... <laughs> I can't remember all that. Tyler, we have 23, 26, 28 through 60. If you want to give us a different box, right? I apologize. I didn't upload it. Upload it on the old screen there. Two spots left in the quad mini. Do, 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 do. I like this jersey series. We got a lot of new uh, stuff landing. We might do. We got some cool jerseys coming in. Players we haven't seen before. Yep. Maybe another teammate series. Mmm. Mmm. Twenty three. Mmm. Twenty three. I don't think we have twenty. Did I say twenty? You said twenty three. Did I? Let me ask. Hell yeah. Yeah, we do. MJ. Jordan. The old Jordan brand. Okay, let's do it. There we go. Tyler, best of luck, man. Let's see what we got for a Mega Box jersey for you. The hits, the possibilities are endless. What was Joe Maurer? That'd be awesome. And the hit looks like it is a... Oh, this is a sick jersey. This is a sick jersey. Chris, Miami Marlins, Gary Sheffield. Oh, that is a cool jersey. That's really cool. That's a guy we never see in the breaks. Gary Sheffield, Miami Marlins. Now, they would have been the Florida Marlins Florida with this Marlins. colorway. Now they're the Miami Marlins, of course, but now... That is an awesome jersey. Good hit, Tyler. Number 10. Custom jersey, so no Marlins decals on there. Perfect for framing, though. If you're a Gary Sheffield guy. 
Didn't Gary Jeff Gary, Gary Sheffield Jr. also play in the MLB for a little bit? Um, I already know the answer to that. He did. That's a nice pull. Take that. Don't you, baby? Don't you? Uh, yeah, Gary Sheffield Jr., I think he did. It's a good hit, Tyler. Slime said, I'm going to have to panhandle tomorrow. What's panhandle mean? Uh, you have to sign up at the row, at the intersection. <laughs> That's what panhandle is? I believe so. Like, to, like, need money? Yeah. Here's a cup? Yeah. Tyler, congrats, buddy. Slime says maybe the only non-juiced 500 home run hitter to not get into Cooper Sound. You think, it, like, I don't know about, like, Willie Mays. You think he juiced? I don't think he did. Chris Marletto with a personal mega jersey. Okay, Chris. The world is your oyster. Only wants box 35, Chris. You already called it? Yep, he said this is the last one for a while, so make it a hot one. Chris, it'll be the last one till tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> All right, 35. <whistles> Guys, all tips for tonight will be sent to Garrett Campbell for his birthday, except for the tips sent to me. I keep those. <laughs> If you want to send a tip to Garrett Campbell, his cash app is on the screen. My cash app's also on the screen if you guys are feeling generous. For all the hard work that I do here in the UA Live break room. All tips are split between the host as well and the producer. So, no. <laughs> I'm not getting any of that. No chance, amigo. Sorry, we haven't got a tip in a while. I'll give you a tip. Saddening. Get a new line of work. <laughs> I'm not keeping Chris it. Chris Barletto, uh, we do not have Venmo. I have cash app, though. No Venmo. For me. Actually, I locked out of Venmo. I remember you telling me about that. <laughs> I can't send anything but no. Two right. spots left in that quad. Could we close that out for... Uh, so let's do this. We'll put a cap on it. Maybe. Let's wait till 10, 10 p.m., five, five minutes left to close out that quad, and that'll end it for the list for the Devontae Adams. Okay. And that's how I roll. Remember, all tips sent to Garrett, go to Garrett. All tips sent to me, go to Garrett. Except for, no, they won't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, that's great. So we'll close the buying for the giveaway at 10 p.m. All right, here we go. Chris Barletto. Wow. I think we pulled this actually in our flag day, uh, our 4th of July mixer earlier. I was excited to see this name. Excited to see him again. We have a Clyde, the Glide Drexler. Now, I commented earlier on this. Well, we, poured, we did pull him earlier in the 4th of July mixer. Clyde Drexler is one of the only guys I've seen to sign his name on both numbers. Clyde Drexler. Oh, huh. it's cool. I, I don't really see that much. I don't I really, know if I've ever seen it. I really like Where's that. Where's it started? Right here. Pretty cool. That's cool. And it's I also cool. commented that he was the one reason that uh, Portland didn't pick Michael Jordan. Yep. The one with Sam Bowie instead. I mean, if I'm the Blazers at that point, yeah. I'm not thinking. You don't need him. Clyde, Clyde's a Hall of Famer. He's a dream team member. Yeah. Like, he was no slouch. Yeah. They just passed up on Michael Jordan. You know what I mean? Who? Like that. In, in in retrospect, they're like, wow, what could have been? But like, I don't think either of them would have been as successful if one of them gets drafted to that team. Because you have to share the role. Drexler got main focus for that Portland team. Yeah, that's true. And Jordan obviously main focus in Chicago. That's I don't know. It. Just a yeah, little thought. Would, would they have been successful if they got drafted the same team? Yeah, they probably would have made it work. Hell yeah, they would have. <laughs> but they wouldn't have been, I suppose, as greatness if I want to back up my point. Which I probably shouldn't because it doesn't make sense. Boy, do I want a damn hot dog. 
I want to get one after the show. One spot one? left. One. Three spot. Three minutes left in that giveaway. Three minutes left. You want to snag that last spot within the last three minutes, you'll or, still be entered into the Devontae Adams. Or buying anything. Correct. Correct, correct, correct. Elijah Wan, a member of Pi Slamma Jamma. What's that? Don't you wish your girlfriend was raw like me? All right, it's closed. Joshua Tucker. Who? Joshua Tucker bought the last spot in that quad. All right, cool. That worked out perfectly. Five minutes to spare. We got two minutes left in that giveaway. We'll close it at ten. And this mega or this quad may close it out for the night. Thank you guys so much for all the participation tonight. Good show. Mighty good show. Some cool stuff came Is that that stuffer six? Seven. Sheesh. Jeanette Lee actually just jumped into a nine. Yep. So she nine. Can put in, so she'll get into that. Uh, right. You know what I'm saying? Uh huh. All right, here we go. Oh, crud. Oh, fudge. Except I didn't say fudge. I said the word. All right, so it's 10 p.m., guys. The giveaway is uh, officially wrapped up. We're going to use the names that we have in that list for the free Devontae Adams helmet that we're giving away tonight for Customer Appreciation Week. Guys, thanks so much for the support. That was an awesome night. Awesome stuff. So we got 22, 23, 24, and 25. Bought a personal four wit uh, four stat, wit stat stuff. I'll take forty one and sneak me in the Adams helmet, please, Kevin. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. All right, here we go. First of four. Oh, tiny bag. Already a win. Heisman Trophy winner, nineteen ninety eight. First timer with us, Brad Zissau in the AFC oh. East. Nice. Ricky Williams. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Hell yeah, baby. That's supposed to be excitement for his first like, oh. like, He's doing two things at once. Oh, yeah, it's good. It's good job, right? Brad, nice hit, buddy. Six. Six. Uh, this is a Williams. Mini. Ricky, Ricky Williams, man. Don't you? Bam, 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 bam. Next one. What's up, JC? Yeah. Nice pull. One of the best at this position in franchise history. For the San Francisco 49ers, tight end Vernon Davis. That's a guy we don't see very often either. That's a cool hit. For Katrina Perrine. For college. Vernon Davis? You know it. You know it. I do. What is it? Give the chat a second answer. 
Right. He is... I don't think you get it. Is it a wacky college? Is it a wacky college? Yeah. Give me a hint, give me a hint. They're in the Big Ten now, but we're in the Big Ten all the time. Okay. Nebraska? Yeah? No. Oh! Maryland? Maryland. Dave Harris, nice. Maryland is correct. The Terrapins! Bow, wow, 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 wow. 24 of 50? This guy is out of the U. Running back longest tenure with the Washington, at the time, Redskins. We actually have a football team mini. This is pretty cool. For the football team. Clinton Portis. Another one for Brandon Chong. Brandon is hot in the NFC East tonight. There you go, B. Chong. Nice hit. Six or three, yeah. A nice little mini there. I'll take that. I haven't seen many Washington football team minis. I kind of like that new look. Uh, apparently in 2022, they're changing the name back to something else. You know that? I just heard it wouldn't be the Warriors. It's not going to be the Warriors. Apparently the owner is very against the Warriors. What do you think it's going to be? I have no clue. The Turtle Doves? The French hens. Swans are swimming. The geese of laying. Yes. The gold rings. All right. Here we go. We have a... That's an awesome hit. This is a guy we don't see often. I mean, we're pulling some really fun stuff out of this mini helmet series. This is Thomas Davis, Carolina Panthers for Brandon Fox in the NFC a South. Brandon Fox gets him one in the NFC South. Thomas Davis, linebacker, I believe. Brandon Fox. Uh, who won the winner take all? It was Alcala, Michael Alcala. Acosta. Acosta. That I have a friend, Michael Alcala. That's why I thought about that. Michael Acosta. Thanks, Chris. You were right. Close. Kind of. Michael. Yeah, I went to high school. Close about a horseshoe and a hand grenade. Quite the night. Oh, what a night. Wow, that was fun, huh? It sure was. Is it time for the giveaway, Chris? Yeah, yeah, just double checking, make sure they're all everybody's entered. Just give me one minute. Uh, what were the pull? The helmets pulled. We pulled a Dante Culpepper Eclipse, a Dwayne Bow Eclipse, a Dwight Stevenson Lunar Eclipse. We also pulled a Maurice Jones Drew Amp. That was cool. And a Eric Molds Buffalo Bills Speed Replica. Damn! How about that memory, huh? Woo! Like the encyclopedia up here. Helmets. I mean, it was only like four hours ago. Well, no. Maybe eight hours ago. Yeah. Memory. All right, one more name now. Uh, I'll have you updated. Yeah. All right, one more name is in, and then we're good to go. I think you're and this list is loaded. I think you're over 100. This is 112 people in this list. So we got to do two separate? Nope. 
Actually, you want me to give you a second? You want me to do Kevin Malloy's personal first? Yep. Personal for Kevin Malloy, real quick before we do the giveaway for tonight. Chris, let me know when that list is good to go. We'll be You're good to go. You're good to go. Oh, nice pull. This is a guy out of the University of Wisconsin. Now is on the Pittsburgh Steelers. Currently has two brothers in the NFL. This is the fullback, non Abbreviated name, Derek Watt. Derek Watt. Again, JJ, TJ, abbreviations. Get it? We got it. Cool, cool, cool. It's good. It's cool. It's good. It's good. Last call on the Dutch down to 330. Oh, wow. That's pretty good for that item. Last call. Closing time. Time for all the... I don't know the words right there, but he says it's close. Something right there. I'm pretty sure that was close. Finish your whiskey or beer. Derek Watt. Derek Watt. For the mini. Not bad, Kev. Kev, I'm going to uh, Gene and Jude's after this. I have to go way out of the way to my house. Actually, in the op. Yep, not going. Nope. I am, uh. They're probably not even open. Tire Boy, they're open till like 3 a.m. Oh. Mm-hmm. It's time. Time for the free giveaway? Time for the free giveaway. Go for it. Pull this. Here we go. Guys, thank you so much for all the support tonight. Everyone that bought a spot is entered into a top spot wins for a free giveaway for this Devontae Adams speed rep. 112 different individuals. 109, 109 total names. I'm going to get the randomizer up. It's going to take a minute to randomize this. It's going to be a little slow. 109 names. You all ready for this? Are you ready? There we go. It's going to take a second. I'm telling you, it's going to take a minute. Nine times, top spot after nine times is going to be the winner. You guys nervous? Are you nervous? I'm nervous. I'm ready. I'm nervous. Seven. Eight. And our top spot winner. Thank you guys very much for all the support. Customer Appreciation Week, Devontae Adams, speed rep goes to Brandon Chong. Brandon Chong, tell you what, Brandon had quite the night. Brandon hit a ton of items, won a lot of the minis. Brandon now wins the Devontae, the Devontae Adams. Adams. Beautiful. Congrats. Congrats, Brandon. Good there you win. go, my man. Good win. That is beautiful. So gather all your jackets, move into the exits. Hope you have found a friend. This is me leaving. This is me leaving. <laughs> <laughs> this is me leaving. <laughs> Alright guys, that's gonna do it for tonight, I believe. Gonna yeah, wrap it up here in the UA Live Break Studio. What a fun break. That was a lot of stuff, huh, Chris? It was good. It was indeed good. <whistles> Tune in tomorrow. We've got more customer appreciation. Yeah, tomorrow's going to be fun, too. Tomorrow is... 10% off. 10% off. It's enticing. All right, guys. We'll see you guys tomorrow. I'll be back for the noon break. I'll be back for the noon break tomorrow with Dave Everding. Um, and Garrett and Matt at night. Yep, Garrett and Matt at the Thursday night break. Should be fun with the 10% off stuff that we're doing. Uh, stay tuned for more Customer Appreciation Week updates throughout the rest of the week. Guys, thank you very much for all your support here in the UA Live Breaks. Get to sign it off. I'm Donnie, that's Chris, and we'll see you Good guys night, everybody. tomorrow.